All right, I'm here. That's what you're looking for. That's what you're waiting for. I'm here. Should I have quit my job during the pandemic? Because that's what everybody got to say. You know, was it stupid for me? Will I regret it? Do I regret it? Quitting during the pandemic. What was I thinking? Not being accessible. Being in my own head. Was it a good idea? We're going to talk about that today on the Trucker Brown channel. Don't make sure the wolves I came back with a fur I left on the bus and came back in the fur The niggas was happy, my pockets was hurt I talked to the Lord, said the last will be first I'm practice, I'm preaching, this life is a present I'm selling these verses, I feel like a reverend My life is a blessing, I don't Okay, listen Was the pandemic really the best time to do this? <laughs> Probably not Um Do I regret it? No I don't regret it. Hold on, allergies. Hey! <coughs> he got the Rona. No, it's Las Vegas got some terrible allergies. Um, do I regret it? No. I basically, you know, when it was offered to me to go back full OTR, refrigerated, I just knew that's not what I wanted to do. I knew that I would, I would hate the job. And when you hate the job, then you slack on the job, and then mistakes happen, and then. You know, you're not checking things. It's, it's, I just didn't want to be OTR no more. I've known for about a year and a half that it's about time for me to come off the road. I've known this. I've said it in live feeds if you pay attention to it. I said, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm ready. I said, one more year OTR and I'm getting out of the game. So when I, you know, the number one rule is don't read the comments. That's number one. Sometimes now that I have time on my hands sometimes between the ins and outs that I'm doing here and figuring everything out here, I will, um, I will, I will glaze through and, and some of the stuff I see, I feel can mislead some people watching. Now, the number one concerning factor, well, the number one factor you hear people saying is that, oh, you've been telling people to be OTR for years. I also told people to be OTR for two years. Get your stuff situated and then come off the road. I was LTR for eight years. So it's safe to say that I, you know, hold on, let me check my microphone. It's safe to say that I paid my dues. I, I'm not someone who just started in the game and said, oh, six months later, I don't want to drive. I've been doing this for eight years. Okay? Eight years. I've done my time. So at this point, I'm saying for my personal happiness that I don't I don't want to be OTR anymore. You hear me? So, you know, if no one, I was never offered a job to not be OTR. I'm cool as long as I'm OTR. I'm just done with that. If that opportunity is not where, you know, I was, then it's time for me to leave for me and that place because I'm looking for something that this this place doesn't do. And, you know, they're trying to offer me something I don't want to do anymore. So it is time to part ways, amicable as friends. That's that's what I did. So I don't see anything wrong with that, number one. Number two... My situation really isn't like everybody else's. You know, I'm not tripping. <laughs> like, I'm not tripping, man. I'm not tripping. I'm not telling you I'm not eating. I'm not sleeping outside. I'm not doing any of those things. I'm figuring my life out. You know, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm figuring my life out. And that takes time. That takes time. You know, I'm not, you're not going to be able to reach me because I'm figuring out what I want to do with my life. I probably will lose friends because I ain't answering the phone. I don't want to talk. I don't want to hear, oh, you know what you should do. I don't want to hear that. I want to figure out what I want to do for me the way I want to do it. You're done. That's what's going on right now. Now, is there better ways to do it probably, but I don't know them. 
You know, I'm I'm look for local jobs. I may even look for jobs that have nothing to do with uh, freight. It'll be a trucking to some sense, but I may not be moving freight from shipper to shipper. I may do something else. I mean, wouldn't wouldn't it be dope to do something else? Or do you just want to hear about the same thing all the time? The same thing all the time. I don't see how y'all don't get tired of that. You know, it has to be room to grow. It has to be room to grow. That's all I'm saying. And me, I'm, 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 I'm trying to, I'm trying to grow. I'm trying to do different things. Also, I want to, uh, if I can do it, I want to try to be able to work for a company nobody knows I work for. You hear me? I'm not trying to lend my platform to another company. You know, my platform's about me and the regime, and I don't want to lend that to nobody. I'm not interested. Because usually when you lend your platform to people, they don't really look on paying you for it. Now, um, I will still say go to RST because it's a good deal. And I made money there, and I had a ball there. Um, sorry about the bumper, Chris. I know you're probably pissed off about that, but... I'm sorry. It happens. I, I parked in the wrong place. Someone hit it. It's a big deal. But from moving forward, if it is not RST or or because I know Chris personally, he wants something. I'll give it to him because he's a good guy. He just is. He's just a good guy. There's no other way to put it. Like it's, he's a stand up good dude. But if he needs something, I'll give it to him. But these companies moving forward. Or whatever I do, a no one. I don't want to want to know where I'm at, so I will not be confirming or denying where I work. Number two, they gonna have to pay me. That's a fact, though, because companies and more not Chris Prime type companies, the bigger companies, they will act like you being there don't mean anything when that is just mathematically incorrect. Why well, still get those people without you? You could, you still grow. Still be a millionaire, you still be all that. But at the same time, if that's the case, then why do you want a piece of it? Why do you why do you want to be involved in it at all? If you're not willing to pay for it. So I don't even want to promote any trucking company. You know what I mean? If I don't know them personally, like I know Chris. And I was there for two or three years and the money's real and it's no BS. And I have people over there who are still making money there during the pandemic so it's not like it's not real but the rest of you companies no nah. i'm gucci you know it took time to build the trust that me and rst and chris have that takes time that's something that's like you know it takes time these new people i'm not even interested one second I'm not even interested. I don't want no parts of it. I don't want no parts of the politics of it. I don't want no parts of of uh, what should I say when I should say it. I just want to say whatever I want to say. I'm only representing one person. And that's me. And um, I say what I want when I want. And I don't never want to play that game again. That's a fact, though. Uh, where am I? It's not important. Just know I'm one of the lousy. <laughs> I'm on the low. They looking for me, but they never find me. Um, let's know I'm near family. Uh, you know, I just know I'm working on myself. And, and let's say if I am going through things, it's for it's my private life to go through. And I'm going through those things because you know I could easily jump back into an OTR job and make decent money because that's the main people that's been calling my phone. Go TR, go TR, go TR. Like I've done it. Not interested. Not interested. I've gotten 26 inquiries about that. I don't want to go OTR. And that seems just like, oh, that's the only thing you're good at doing. Maybe that may be, but you know what? I'm not going to do it. I'm not interested. So until someone calls me with a dedicated lane where I want it, I'm good. Moving hand in hand on the street as I'm doing now. Um, just know I'm not on the street. I'm not living in a hotel, right? <laughs> uh, 
I'm, uh, I'm just trying to get the comment stuff out of the way. I'm not arrogant. But let's go, maybe honestly, I don't know. Um, I'm um, I'm working on me finally, with no one else in mind. I've given enough to the game, to the YouTube portion of the game. I've given enough to people. I'm not giving nothing else. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing. I've given enough. It's about me right now. And me trying to find what's a good place from where I need to be at. No one else. There's a fact though. So listen, man, I appreciate you coming to the Trucker Brown channel. Um, I know I'm gonna get some talks about the way this looks. It's number one, this looks awesome. Let's get that out of the way. Um, new lens. I'm not gonna tell you which one it is. Just know this is a new lens and it is sharp. Um, new light situation. So anywhere I'm at, I can just pop this out, point it at a wall, and talk to y'all. <sighs> There's no one working on me. And if, if people was ever really my friend, they would give me time to work on myself. You hear me? So you won't you shouldn't want a friend that's unhappy. That's a fact. So just like give me time to do that. You know, I'm hanging with my family, my nephews and nieces, and you know, I'm chilling. Chilling with my brother, getting much needed uh uh quality time with my brother because I've for the past five years he's been here and I have been able to spend time with him and um my advice to the people who are looking at me trying to decipher exactly what's going on and why I made my moves listen to me there will come a time I know you feel like life is this forever it is not there will come a time where you're done you understand Hopefully, you've either got another stream of income, or you've paid stuff off, or you know enough people in the world for you to be able to go do what you need to do, where you need to do it. Get my focus right. Where you need to do it. I have got to that place. Love truck, and I do. And I'm probably going to keep doing it. But the OTR portion of it, I've done eight years, dime. Until you done years like that, don't discuss how long or what I should be doing. Right? If you watch me to get in the game, went to my companies, failed quickly, and went back home to drink douce, you ain't in the position. You ain't the caliber, to be honest. You just not the caliber. You a dud, and you know it. Now, I could be ignorant on you and say some ignorant stuff, but I'm not gonna do that. Just know I'm fine. I'm good. And I don't, I don't, I don't do news channels about other people. To me, that's like sucking dick. Personally, that's what it sounds like. Sounds like my dick's in your mouth. But my dick is usually in these niggas' mouth anyway. Oh, TP, how are you talking? Ain't no company watching me. The new regime is over this. So I want you to get this, all y'all to get this clear. Stop sucking my dick. Because y'all been choking on my dick for five years now. You're not going to catch me. <laughs> Your channel's crap. It sucks. That's why it ain't growing. So please pull my dick out your throat. Now, do what daddy tells you and keep making videos about daddy. But no. Every time you do, my dick goes one more inch down your throat. And everybody knows it. I'm news to you bitch-ass niggas. That's a fact. I'm news. When I make a move, they make news about it. When y'all do shit, no one ever hears about it. That's a fact. So, kill yourself. I've been waiting to say that to y'all niggas for years. <sighs> Please kill yourself. That's what I want you to do. <laughs> like, I don't want you to please stop breathing. Insignificant ones. You hear me? The original. The reason why you in trucking and YouTube, bitch nigga. That ain't one person. That's 80% of you motherfuckers. Back to my high ears. I don't believe everything you see. The serving and the 
Harder to leave, it's easy to slave, it's hard to be free. I walk in this bitch and I'm telling the truth. I still press a nigga outside of the booth. Was talking crazy like you missing the two. Keep on rapping, I'ma make this shit true. Old soul better act like you knew. Your mama better.